Hello everyone, welcome to Homework Help. If you find the video useful, please subscribe to the channel. So in this video, we'll solve this problem using the concepts of tan function. So as per the problem, what is the value of tan of 92 pi over 3? And we are given these four answer choices. The first step is to analyze the given tan function, tan of 92 pi over 3. 92 pi over 3 is an angle in radians and this angle value is greater than 2 pi. This angle is not on unit circle. So we have to simplify this angle expression. So we should change the fraction 92 over 3 into a mixed form. 92 over 3 is an improper fraction. We want to change it to a mixed number or mixed number fraction. So we have to find how many times 3 goes evenly and that's 30 times. The denominator will be 3. 30 times 3 is 90. So 92 minus 90 is 2. So that's the remainder and that goes in the numerator. So 92 over 3 can be written in mixed number form as 30 2 thirds. Since the period of tan function is pi, we can rewrite tan 92 pi over 3 as tan of 2 pi over 3. We use the proper fraction from the mixed number form. The reason why we are able to do that is because the period of tan function is pi and there are 30 holes in 92 over 3. So we are able to change tan of 92 pi over 3 into tan of 2 pi over 3. So there is a very important concept we need to understand to solve this type of problem. Next, we can use ASTC rule or the cast rule also called all sad turtles cry rule or the unit circle to evaluate tan 2 pi over 3. 2 pi over 3 lies in quadrant 2. As per the cast rule or the ASTC rule, tan is negative in quadrant 2. The reference angle or the related angle for 2 pi over 3 is pi over 3. So we can rewrite tan 2 pi over 3 as negative tan pi over 3. Tan pi over 3 is equal to square root of 3. So we can find this using the unit circle or the special triangle. If we use the special triangle, we have to use the pi over 3, pi over 6 and pi over 2 triangle. The formula for tan is opposite over adjacent. For pi over 3, the opposite side length is square root of 3. The adjacent side length is 1. So tan of pi over 3 is equal to square root of 3. The final answer should be negative square root 3, which is option D. So these are the steps you have to keep in mind to solve a problem like this one. So I hope you'll find this video useful. Please share it. Like it and subscribe to Homework Help. Thank you very much and have a nice day. Bye.